evening, good evening, good afternoon, good morning, wherever the show is being shown. I'm here once again on behalf of the famous Magician School, and I know that many of you have expressed a great deal of, uh, well, skepticism as to whether, in fact, there really is a famous Magician School. I'm going to show you just the sort of extraordinary things we can teach you. In fact, I can do some very advanced sort of tricks. I can summon spirits. That's right, they won't come, but I can summon them. And given the circumstance, I think if now is not a good time as any to present the knee plus ultra of illusionary magic, the by now illustrious egg bag illusion. One of your favorites, saying, oh goody, the egg bag. I have here a bag, and coincidentally enough, I do indeed inside have an egg. Hence the name of the illusion, the egg bag. You see the correlation between reality and surreality? Is it not marvelous? Now, the illusion, please, please, it only throws off my timing. I'm going to take this egg, place it in the bag in this manner, and cause it to vanish. Now, what could be simpler? Hmm? What could be simpler? And yet, simple as that illusion may appear, there are some magicians who have a tendency to, to, to cheat. Yes, hold your cry of disdain cheat at the illusion. They perform the illusion like this. They place the egg in the bag, like so. And the egg is actually behind the bag, you see? <laughs> ah, yeah. Now, once the egg's behind the bag, they can turn the bag inside out to show it's vanished, and in doing so, they're actually placing the egg in the bag. Is it not then simplicity itself to produce the vanished egg? Is it not? And yet, Simple as that illusion may appear, there are some magicians who have a tendency to, 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 to cheat even more so. Please hold your cry of declamation, please. Even, I know how you people feel. Try and contain yourselves. You've done very well so far. <laughs> so there, I'm going to show you precisely what I'm talking about. They perform the illusion like this. They place the egg in the bag, like so. And the egg is actually in their hand, do you see? Yeah. <laughs> so simple once you know how it's done, isn't it? Now, once the egg's in their hand, it's a very simple matter indeed, is it not, to secret it under the arm, show that the bag is empty, which of course it is. To regain the egg, they employ the age-old art of misdirection. That is, they hold the bag at arm's length and employ a subtle movement with this hand to momentarily distract your eye. Like this. Give them the map time to get things thought of his hand from the bag. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> Needs work, huh? <laughs> I implore you, you must watch me very closely. You must watch me very carefully, and you must watch me under that most scrutiny. Because the way I perform this illusion, I cheat more than anyone. I'll place the egg in the bag like this. I'll reach into the bag in the same depth fluid, snake-like, dare I say, graceful movement, and turn the bag inside out to show the egg has absolutely irrevocably vanished. Now, there are skeptics, no doubt, who will doubt that at any time the egg was in the bag. Yet those of you who will observe will find the egg has always been in the bag. <laughs> now, no, no, not yet. I'll tell you when. I'll give you a cue for a spontaneous burst of wild applause and hysterical scream, but until I do, Perhaps so there can be no chicanery outside of my control. So there can be no tomfoolery outside of my control. So there can be no prestidigitation outside of my control. Perhaps, Jim, you'd be so kind as to assist me. Would you mind? Can we have a big hand, Mr. Jim Stafford? Yeah. I'd like you to place a finger on either side of the bag to hold it taut thusly. Gotcha. Have you done this before? Never. Did that extremely well. Thank you. <laughs> I'm going to place the egg here in a state of suspension here. Now, Jim, I ask you, can you see the egg? Yes. Yeah, you can. It's quite simple. It's right there, isn't it? You can see the egg. Gets a lot more complicated, folks. <laughs> can the audience see the egg? Yes. yes. Am I here by myself? <laughs> can the audience see the egg? Yes! I don't know if you people understand. You see, what I need here is razor-sharp precision. When I say, can the audience see the egg, I want to hear, yeah! And then, oh, like that. <laughs> this is your last chance. Can the audience see the egg? Yes! 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 It'll have to do. Jim, I ask you, have we ever met before? No. Nope. No, indeed, we have not. I'm going to pull this much on the bag to cause the egg to drop into the bag. Did you see the egg drop into the bag? I saw it. Yes, indeed, you did. 
Did the audience see the egg drop into the bag? Yes! Yeah. Better. Now, I don't want you to leave, but I'm going to take this bag for just a moment, please. This good gentleman who will testify in any court in land we've never met before in our entire natural lives hold bags that are thing to it. Hmm? That's true. And yet, reaching into the bag in the same death graceful snake like liquidy fluid motion, I'll turn the bag inside out one more time to show him in close range, takes once again irrevocably vanish. Jim, ask you one more time to re-ascertain for the benefit of those audience who are not just in the first place. We've never before our tarn natural lives have enough. The answer is no, regardless of the question. That's right. Would you reach into the bag and tell me what you find? Sure. The egg! I 